Hey guys. Okay. So in this tutorial, we're going to go quickly over some of the debug tools that I use a lot, um, which is mainly only two. It's going to be uh, debug.log and the debug.drawline. So we're going to get right into it here. And let's make a game object really quick. Just create an empty one. And we're going to call it manager debug. We're going to come into our scripts folder. As you can see, I created the materials, objects, scenes, scripts, uh, shaders, and textures folder just to keep everything separate. And we're going to create a C sharp script. So I pretty much write everything in C sharp. We're going to call it as debug tools. And open that up in monitor develop. We're going to jump straight into the uh, on. GUI function here and add a button. And we'll put it in the top left corner. Just give it a name of log. Okay, and then we'll make the function which is debug.log. And there's a lot of things you can log here. Um, pretty much anything that's string related. Uh, a lot of positions can be logged. Um, if you're actually just debugging a script and want to see where it stops, uh, you can use debug log, and I use that a lot. We're just going to send it a string of hello. Okay, save that. Jump back to Unity. And on our manager debug object, just going to throw the debug tools script on there and run it. And you can see way down at the bottom here, my console, console will still show up. Let's hit that a few times. And let's stop and make sure our console actually read all of those clicks. And you can see it did, read four of them. Now this next one, I'm for the debug dot draw line. I'm not going to maximize on play because the draw line is actually going to only show in your scene here, not in your game. So you can see I created the two points, and we want to draw a line between those two points. Usually when I use this, uh, it's for when I I want to see when this object enters this object's area or if I just want to see where they are related to each other on the scene. So let's jump back to monitor develop. Let's go into our let's top of the script. Let's make uh, two new public transforms. Say point one and point two, and in the update statement, we want to do debug dot draw line, and the vector three start is just going to be point one dot position, and the second one is going to be point two dot position. Okay, save that. Come back to our manager debug. We're going to have to add point one and point two. And we can run it. Now you can see there's a line between the two objects here. And we can move this up and down. You can see that the line moves with them. Now, if white really isn't your color, then we can jump back to our script and let's make it red. And if we run it, you can see that the line's now red.